Hi everyone, I'm Emily Schmidt, third generation family member at Sukup Manufacturing. Greetings from the Tech Center at our headquarters here in Sheffield, Iowa. Today we are talking about something that is vital to the future of farming, and that is connectivity. One of our values here at Sukup is to ensure that our customers have the tools and technology to be efficient and profitable. Access to reliable high-speed internet is just one piece of the puzzle. As you know, Connectivity is already a major need in our everyday lives, and our dependence upon it only continues to increase. Rural customers like America's farmers are often faced with limited choices and high costs for broadband access. In 2010, Sukup introduced its first bolt-on IoT device, the GSM modem, and that offers customers the ability to remote communicate with their equipment, for example, using a text message to get the current unload speed of your Sukup dryer. Since that time, our grain storage, drying, and handling equipment has become more and more connected and technical. Our MySukup Cloud platform continues to grow, and Sukup has established itself as a leader in technology-forward grain management. In the agriculture industry, the need for high-speed, reliable internet service has never been more important. We feel the need for a reliable internet, even more so in rural parts of the country where most farming operations are located, just like our headquarters here in America's heartland. Today, we are going to demonstrate for you a tool that could be a game changer when it comes to bringing internet access to your farm. I'm talking about low earth orbit satellite internet. Some of you may have heard of this technology. It's an emerging alternative to traditional forms of wired broadband internet access. Now we're ready. Emily and I both have kids at home, and one thing that they love to do is watch these unboxing videos all the time. Let's go ahead and unbox a brand new receiver that connects with our low earth satellites. This is one unboxing video I am excited for. It's like Christmas morning. match any any grain bin out there and now we are going to take it one step further and show you some examples of the receiver at work on Iowa farms we've arrived here at Manning's farm and uh, they're longtime customers for us here at Suga manufacturing this is Joe and this is Bob uh, Bob can you tell us a little bit uh, about your farm site here well we have uh, 1.3 million bushel of grain storage uh, grain dryer farm around 8,000 acres, uh, row crop, and uh, able to store 90% of it here on, on site. And uh, the uh, internet is uh, a big part of it anymore. Well, we love visiting uh, our customers and, and even more love uh, family farms like yourself. 96% of, of farms are family owned farms. So uh, today we're doing a little different type of visit here. So uh, I, I say, let's get started. Started farming here about 25 years ago, and it was a little close to town then, but uh, town seems to be uh, coming closer all the time every day, and uh, we're just about a mile and a half from the new school, a $128 million school that just uh, got built. Lots of construction, cutting our internet lines daily, at least weekly, and uh, it just uh, it's getting real aggravating. So on the DSL, it would cut our line and it would be multiple days for us to get internet back. Everything is internet. I mean, you got to have it. We run our trucks off internet. We run uh, our grain dryer, our Sukup grain dryer. When dad and I are in the fields and the combines, we can watch, you know, the moisture coming out, the moisture coming in, you know, change the plenum temp, uh, bin levels. So with, when that internet would get cut, it would, you know, pretty much shut down our operation. So when we switch to wireless uh, from the DSL, we're about 15 down and with the DSL we were down to you know three to five down the wireless got us to 15 down we need we're gonna need more as we grow we're gonna hook up our uh, a satellite internet okay. uh, today and again that low earth orbit satellite so the first thing we need to do is we need to plug in this power adapter right here this is gonna power our dish okay. and our uh, router uh, over PoE 
So okay. power over ethernet. So that's already plugged in. The next thing we need to do is mount the dish. Okay. So out of the box, they give us this kind of mount right here. Okay. Let's go ahead and put that right on top of the souk up centrifugal fan. Okay. And I'm gonna hand you just a couple of zip ties. We just wanna make it stable enough. Okay. So I'm gonna give you these two. Thank you. All right, here's the dish. Okay. Now watch your fingers here. Okay. That'll kind of click into the base. Yep. And the cable's already connected. So while you're doing that, so we'll just plug that right in there and it's actually gray for gray, right? Yep. Can't screw it up. And as it moves, I think this will actually start to connect here in just a second. Okay. So we're gonna watch for that piece of it. And then go ahead and plug the router in. This is one that's provided okay. with it. It just plugs into the white port on the, uh, the power adapter. Yep. And you just go ahead and set it up there. So right now, that satellite is creating a downlink. Okay. And uh, usually takes a few minutes. What I'm gonna do, oh, oh there it there goes. It so perfect, it's gonna be searching for the signal and it'll probably move a little bit more as it goes through, there it goes. So it's searching for that. At the same time, I'm gonna go ahead and let's pull this up here on the phone. This is connected to the, uh, uh, to the router and then it's gonna give us the information through there. Okay, so it's just created a downlink. Okay. And we'll be able to, uh, to then set up our network so that we can connect our other devices in. All right. Nice job. Thank you. So after this test, we've kind of seen, you know, about a 10 time speed increase. Um, you know, how does that uh, sit with you guys? To be a Starlink connected uh, farm, it would be a huge asset for us. Even on the trucking side, to, to be able to contact our employees, uh, be safer on dispatching, even maybe have tablets in all their trucks so they can look at loads. And yeah, we've uh, upgraded our monitoring system in there considerably, but uh, uh, without going here to check it, it'd be nice to be able to pick that up on your phone, uh, off the internet, seeing where our bin levels are at, our loadout bin, our uh, wet bin, wet tank going to the dryer. We have the capabilities here, but not, not, getting, it, not getting it to us. Look, Sukup's whole goal in this is to provide products and solutions to make farming more manageable make it efficient, make it profitable, and above all, to improve the quality of life within the agriculture industry. If you'd like to learn more about connectivity or Starlink for your farm, you may contact Sukup by emailing solutions at sukup.com.